hello everyone welcome back to the channel in this video we will learn how we can resize a photograph how we can resize an image for that we need a module called pillow and how we can install pip install pillow is the command for that actual use case is to reduce the photo size to reduce the image size how we can do that we just need to open that image change the dimension and save the image with the new dimensions and that's it so let's get started i have already created one python file image underscore resizer dot py you can keep another name also i have already kept one photo with the name photo one dot jpg and the dimension for that photos are 1920 into 1080 and the size is 533 kb so we will reduce the dimension and its size will automatically reduce i will show you the picture as well so this is the picture that we are going to play with i closed it now let's get back to the code so to get started we need a pillow module so let's first install it so how we can install pip install pillow so this is already installed in my case you can install your own and then start your coding how we can import the pillow module we can import the pillow module using from pil import image instead of pillow we need to use pil so it actually refers to pillow module only pil means python imaging library right so we have imported the pil and the and its class image now we need to get the location of the image for which we are going to do the resizing so i will type it as input underscore path and we have already seen that the name of our photograph is photo one dot jpg it's not kpg it's jpg and then we will save the new image the new resized image in output path named as let's say output one dot jpg right so you can give the absolute path also for the images so this image is in my base location so i am giving the direct name no base path is required for it now we need to change the dimension of image to change the dimension we need to change the bit and the height of the image so let's take a variable new bit let's suppose it is 200 and new height also take it as 200 only right so we have new bit in place we have new height in place now we will just open the image using image dot open command and we will provide the path to the photo right now we have opened the image and now we will resize this image so we will take the variable as resize image and then what we can do we will call the image and we will call the resize function and inside resize what we need to take care of we need to provide the width and height in a tuple form right so we will give new width comma new height now you can see i have provided this inside the these brackets so it is a tuple for us right so this will resize our image now we will save this resized image so that we can see the changes resize image dot save we need to write 
with what name with the output path we can say so the resized image will get the name of output one dot jpg that's it you're done now now let's print the message also that image is resized and available at where output path and that's it control s and then run this code so we can see image is resized and available at output one dot jpg let's go back to our location now you can see output one dot jpg is available here with the dimension of 200 and the size is 11.6 kb you can see that so we have actually changed the size of the image now let's create one more photo with some other dimensions let's suppose 600 i would say 600 for width 600 for height and then give another name output 2 dot jpg and then save it and run this so code is saying image is resized and available at output 2 dot jpg so let's check it out output 2 dot jpg now you can see dimension is 600 and 600 and size is 92.8 kb and this time size is larger than that so this was the original image this is the 600 by 600 image and this is 200 by 200 image so this is how you can actually play around with the image sizes thank you